What's up guys, welcome back to the video. Since it's summertime, we are getting in some studying at the pool. Gotta take advantage of the sunlight when you can. Today was pretty easy, went to lab uh, in the morning, did some class three composites, drilled a little bit, filled a little bit, and then we took probably one of the easiest finals I've ever taken, undergrad included. Didn't look at a single slide. I think I did the numbers, if I got a zero, I still had like a 92% in the class. So that was fun going in, zero pressure. Um, the rest of the day is just going to be studying, trying to get ready for the physiology final. Got anything to say, Cam? Uh, it looks like we're studying, but we're not doing a whole lot, if we're being honest. So. I think I've been on the same slide on my computer for about an hour. Anyways, see you guys in a bit. All right, guys, we are back from the pool. Got a solid, fun study session in there. It's always good to get some of the vitamin D production in the body up. Study outside whenever you can. It just makes you feel better. It feels like, uh, makes you feel like you're not stuck inside all day. Because honestly, that can just get overwhelming after a lot of time, and it just makes you miserable. Anyways, before we start this video, I wanted to talk to you guys about a few things. First, um, from the bottom of my heart, I want to say thank you to everyone who supported the Fine Balance launch last week. I was uh, so surprised with how many orders we got. We are exactly halfway to funding a complete cleft palate surgery for a child who is not able to afford it. And I can't even express how grateful I am, how awesome I, you guys are. The response has been um, completely higher than what I ever expected. So a big shout out to you guys. Um, I hope we can keep it going and get 100% of the money donated to funding a cleft palate for a child and really sincerely change that little kid's life forever. The next thing that I want to talk to you guys about is also about Fine Balance and it is all about the girls clothing line and I have ordered two samples. They are going to get here hopefully within the next week or two. They are racer back tank tops for the girls. Um, I wanted you guys to be included, obviously. I think they're gonna be, I think they're gonna look awesome. They're gonna be clothes that you guys can be proud of wearing. They're gonna look good, they're gonna be comfortable, and it can get you out of the house and help you, and help you find that balance, get away from school for a little bit, be active. And also we're gonna do the same donation as a t-shirt. So every shirt you buy will help fundraise some money going to a great charity. And the last thing that I wanted to say was also another thank you for all the support that I've been getting on Instagram. I've been trying to be really active so you guys can actually see that day-to-day -day grind, what I'm doing every single day, um, what kind of hand skills I'm working on, what classes we're in, and just keep you guys updated with how you are gonna feel, kind of the how busy, how relaxed, free time that you are going to have when you are finally in school, or if you're in school now, you can compare what you're doing to what I'm doing. But huge thanks to everyone who is uh, messaging me on there. I, I also feel overwhelmed from all the support. You guys are rooting for me, and it seriously makes me able to grind that much harder and stay focused that, that much better and feel like even when I'm down, feeling like I'm not on the ball that day, week, or month, you guys are there to lift me up. So anyways, huge thanks to all of you guys. Keep up the support, and I hope I can keep providing the content that you guys enjoy. Okay, so now let's get this video started, and I wanted to talk about how important it is to have one of these big whiteboards right here to kind of get the big picture of your month. I on the I think I ended the last video um, saying I was going to fill it out for the month of July, and I have, and it is a lifesaver. It keeps me so much more organized and lets me see all of the tests and when they are and all the assignments due. So I think this is something that is that everyone needs, whether you're in undergrad, even in high school, I never did it in high school, I wasn't that organized. But if you guys really want to stay on top of everything, have one in high school, definitely have one in undergrad, and it's 100% a must when you're in dental school. So this is gonna be my month of July. The first half, kind of really nothing, right here, nothing. But today, Thursday the 12th, ethics final. I already told you guys, probably one of the e easiest finals I've ever taken, ever, seriously. It was awesome. Tomorrow I have a radiology group and it's a really good thing that I wrote this on here because normally I don't go to class on Friday and I would have forgotten except for had it on here. So very huge to keep organized. Keep I put due dates on here when items are due. I don't really have any quizzes this semester but normally I'll have when assignments and quizzes are due as well. 
Anyways, let's keep going. So we see in a week from today, I have my operative practical. So I know kind of this weekend and all Sunday through Wednesday, I need to be practicing drilling and filling to get ready for that. And then we see four days later, I have a fixed practical. So kind of somewhere right around Tuesday or Wednesday of next week, I need to also be starting to practice and get ready for that. Because if I just focus on this and don't, I haven't done a single um, fix, which is the crown restorations, haven't done a single practice use for that, I really don't wanna only give myself three days. So it's super important to see what you have coming up and then you know plan accordingly. Anyways, get done with fixed practical. My last day of class is gonna be the 20, or no, last day of class is gonna be the 27th. The day before that, we have our operative written final. So operative practical, operative written final one week later. So I gotta start pract or reading over all my assignments, going over lectures kind of these four days. And then this is where it comes in huge. I have three finals stacked in two days. And physiology is going to be a huge one. So for this one, I'm already studying. That's what I was studying at the pool today. I'm gonna have to start studying about three weeks before that because of all these extra things that I'm gonna be um, gonna be dealing with. So I can't leave, definitely cannot leave that to these three days. It's gonna take a lot, a lot of hours of going over lecture, PowerPoints, um, going over the readings. And anyways, so we're gonna have to tackle all of these three finals within two days, and I just need to stay organized and not fall behind, because if I do that, I will be screwed and it could ruin my whole entire semester. So if you guys don't have one of these huge whiteboards, I highly, highly recommend it. Um, you can, I got this one from Staples. It was probably only like 20 bucks and it is 100% worth the investment. It will, it, I'm not even kidding you, improve your grades because you're not going to miss assignments. You're not going to miss due dates. You're going to um, know when to start studying for huge tests, exams, and quizzes. Anyways, highly recommend it. You guys definitely need to have a, as big as one as you can up on your wall where you're going to see it every single day to stay organized. All right, this one's for all my fitness freaks out there. If you guys love pancakes, and you should, get some Kodiak cakes, so much protein, throw some peanut butter on there, and instead of using the best syrup in the world, which is Aunt Jemima, and yeah, she would whoop Miss Butterworth in anything, get Walden Farms. I actually found this from all the fitness YouTubers that I watch, and if you turn over, the label is just straight zeros. How they do it, no clue but you're not wasting all your carbs and sugars in one meal uh, with syrup. So, Walden Farms, this is the way to go. It's freaking delicious. It's Friday right now. This morning I woke up, got some studying in that was uh, good to be productive before my day even started. Then I went to the gym, did a pretty strong back workout, and then I had my radiology rotation, so that's why I'm in my scrubs right now, because um, I, you guys know I don't have class on Fridays. Well, I don't go to class on Fridays. The radiology rotation was pretty sweet. We were practicing on a dummy, so we weren't taking x-rays on each other, unfortunately, but it was still pretty cool. We got to practice some bite wings. Pretty much all the teeth we took pictures of of. We had to learn how to set the instrument or the machine up, kind of deal with the angles of the beam and why being farther or closer away can mess up your images. Anyways, it was a good experience. Um, they didn't really go into too much detail about reading them because we were just taking pictures on plastic teeth, but it was a really good intro and all the radiology technicians were super cool. They were just there to help us, um, kind of messing around, joking with us the whole time. So that was uh, a really good hands-on experience and the rest of the day is just gonna be relaxing and probably studying some more physiology. Just got done with a phenomenal Saturday morning workout. Um, I'm going to wrap the video up there. As always, um, subscribe if you guys are new and you've made it all the way to the end and let me know what kind of content you guys uh, want to see if you want to see more lab stuff more um, of my study habits whatever you guys want I want to make sure you guys are enjoying the video as videos as much as possible so thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one